Hey everyone, welcome back to another Mortal Kombat 11 video. In this video, I'm going to be continuing the series that I started a couple of weeks ago where I look at some of the worst variations in the game and we'll take them to practice mode, we'll take them online and see if we can win a couple of matches or a match with them, just one match. The second kind of character to be examined under this series is going to be the second variation of Aaron Black. I have no idea what the fuck the actual name of this variation is. It's competitive, competitive variation number two. This character is absolutely terrible. The reason I didn't start the series with him and I started instead with the uh, Molotov cocktail version of Kano is because I still hold out that as a base character, Aaron Black is way, way better than Kano. And in this variation, he does, of course, keep his standard Aaron Black tools. He has this move as an amazing mid. He has like his mashable strings. Uh, what's the other one? It's like, there it, there it is. So he does keep a lot of his stuff. He can still go into slide and go into the acid. So yeah, as a base toolkit, Aaron Black is still there. He's still here with his stupid crushing blows. But what do you gain in this variation? Well, you gain some fantastic tools. Truly, truly stuff that's worth it. Uh, you get this command grab. Now here's the thing. This command grab is very, very flashy. Animation-wise, it's absolutely top tier. However, as a move, it is god-awful. First things first, just like a lot of the shittier command grabs in this game, it side switches. Second thing you might notice is that it does no damage. Even amplifying it does like 18% damage. God, the animation... 17. God, the animation takes forever too. So like, going with something like this... If you go into the slide and you go into a command grab, even then, 18%, that's nothing. Like, going into a normal grab with Aaron Black after the acid, that does 19, so 1% more, but I think the other throw does even more. So you get this fantastic command grab, which, believe me, he has no good tick throws. Uh, I think he can stick throw off of standing one no he cannot he can stick throw off of crouching uh yeah down three as well down four obviously not standing two no so only those two down pokes he can uh stick throw off of but again like why if you're gonna use something like this you may as well go for a regular grab this command grab isn't a mid or anything either it's just it's just a normal shitty command throw. So he gets that. What does he also get? He gets this TNT move. This TNT move replaces the move where he drops acid. Not like that, but you know, he drops the acid puddle. We'll get into that later. So this thing is unblockable. The only problem with it is how the fuck are you ever supposed to hit your opponent with this? You can hold the wick and make the explosion time less, but then you are completely vulnerable. So you throw this out, and what exactly are you supposed to do? Shooting a bullet uh, pushes the opponent back, so that doesn't work. Going into a fourth throw, fourth four, you get hit. This, this move is stupid. Going into a throw, you just get a basic amount of damage. So, again, just like with the Molotov cocktail move with Kano, what the hell is the point of this thing? Somebody let me know, because I have not been able to find anything useful to do with this fucking move. And, to add insult to injury, I'd say, it hurts Aaron Black as well. Unlike the acid, which for some reason he's immune to, which, you know, if we're gonna be consistent, then by that logic he should be vulnerable to the acid as well. This stupid dynamite, this shitty ass move, hurts him. Sometimes it only hurts him if you're at the wrong distance. So, considering Eren's toolkit, which he always side switches, I mean, his 
main thing is side switching with the slide. How the hell are you ever supposed to hit with this? It's very, very confusing. This Molotov cocktail move, or this fucking dynamite move is one of the worst. Not to mention that it has god-awful startup. I mean, look at how long it takes this thing to start up. Man, fucking terrible. And finally, to complement this fantastic toolkit, Aaron Black gets the ability for one defensive meter to cancel his slides and cancel his forward four, essentially getting like an enhanced dash. So you're this distance and you go for something like this. Uh, you can also go for something like command grab. Yeah, it's essentially an enhanced version of his dash. Now, this move on paper is not bad. You want more mobility with a character like this. However, you have to see the whole picture. This move does not complement this variation's moveset at all. In fact, none of his moves complement each other. Like, how does this unblockable dynamite, this command grab, and this cancel supposed to come together for a co cohesive moveset? They just don't. Especially considering that this variation loses out on so much. So, so much. First things first, he can no longer launch from his rifle stance. So, this variation basically has zero combos going for him. You can only go for something like this. That's about it. No combos, because he can only do this. Nothing, he can shoot and do the low rifle. Yeah. Second thing he loses is all of his advanced strings that he gets in the other variation, you know. Like, this... Wait, what is it? Hold on. Not up to date on my Aaron Black knowledge. Uh, this string has some follow up in the other variation. In this variation, nothing. Like, what the hell am I supposed to do off of it? Not that that move is any useful, but just still, on principle, he also loses out on his other gunshot strings. Just look at the amount of strings he has. This is this is nothing. This is nothing. And the final thing he loses out on in this variation is his counter zoning. This, the other variation has amazing counter zoning and a pretty good projectile with the scuttle shot or scut shot I think it's called. This variation doesn't have that. There is no way. If you're full screen and you run out of bullets, uh, there's absolutely nothing you can do. So, as stated with the Kano variation, these bad variations in MK11 just seem to be very confused. Like, I think they just went with what moves they thought were cool because you gotta admit, this move is pretty cool. And they didn't even think about making a cohesive character, so... Yeah, it's not good. Again, th I, the reason I didn't start the series off with him is because, again, at a core, Aaron Black's toolkit, I would say, is stronger than a character like Kano's. But still, this variation, this variation is god-awful. So what are we gonna do with it? We're gonna take it to fucking Combat League. Yeah, I'm gonna drop down a rank, aren't I? Well, I'm only gonna play one match because I feel like any more uh, I would be seriously risking things. Yeah, as you can see, I'm not like super advanced, but that's because I missed out a week on Combat League while I was away. But I'm working towards at least getting that Grandmaster rank. I gotta, I gotta. And I feel like playing this variation ain't gonna help the situation. But let's see what happens. Uh, Wi-Fi 2. I'm willing to sacrifice for your entertainment. So yeah, let's see. Let's see if this variation just on the principle of Aaron Black's toolkit being pretty strong. Let's see if we can make anything work here. This is a Wi-Fi warrior too, which I feel like when I did the Kano one, that was... We fought a Wi-Fi warrior too, right? I don't remember. Oh god, this is gonna be awful. Barking Irons even has a stupid name, uh, you gotta admit. Oh god, I can feel the lag. I can feel the lag. This is gonna be terrible. This is gonna be terrible. I've not... This, this variation has nothing. Nothing going for it. Just gotta go for them command grabs. Hmm. Let's see. Alright, 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 alright.
Oh, oh. Sub Zero Online is a fun character. Oh, okay. We have a maniac. Okay, he's went for the he's gone for the overhead option a lot of times now. Okay, a Wi-Fi playing Sub Zero. This is pretty much the worst opponent I could have ever dreamed of fighting with this character. Uh, of course. Eat this fucking throw and hold this long ass animation too. I meant to cancel it. I forgot that it's L2 to cancel it, not fucking 4. Oh god. Ooh. How the hell did that not punish? Eat the command grab. Bam. No! No! I meant to command grab and he side switched. Shit! I should mash. Oh yeah. Still got that. Still got probably the best fatal blow in the game. Aside from maybe Jax? Hell yeah. Hey, I'm gonna roll and immediately wake up fatal blow. It's pretty much the classic Aaron Black. I'm never gonna be able to like slide cancel in on this guy. That's for sure. Oh yeah, that's the classic. Maybe you just gotta play like a maniac with this character. Oh, command grab. Get into the corner. Watch this. Oh, is that what is... Man, I never seen that before. Is that what is jumping whatever it looks like? I'm pretty sure I tagged that. Fucking hell, if he kills me, I'm gonna be so pissed. No, he's not. Alright, you're gonna have to hold the command grab. I feel like, just like with the Kano video, well, first of all, this guy is awful, as in the connection. Uh, I feel like none of that had to do with the actual tools the character has in, like, variation wise. It pretty much came down to the base character toolkit. So yeah, yeah, that was... Thank you, Fatal Blow, for saving me. Oh, fuck. This guy is just trying to piss me off, right? Some of the best characters to play against online. Are Sonya Blade and Sub-Zero. A lot of fun, a lot of fun. We have fun here with Mortal Kombat 11. If I actually win this fucking set, that's gonna be... Incredible. Round one. Fight. Oh, wonderful. Oh, fuck. Maybe it does Oh, come on. Fucking maniac. He just commits. Are you... You have got to be shitting me. I was gonna say hold this comeback, but... Yeah, an absolute maniac. Absolute maniac. Shit, that's still not it to cancel. Yes, I stood up, but... You have got to be fucking kidding me. It's unsafe. Yeah, just... He's standing in it. Oh, I'm so dead. Just keep jumping. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> you know, you know how it is. 
I was like, if he fatalities, I'm gonna throw my controller at the screen. But does she, does she just like peace out? I've never seen this outro. Yeah, she just pieces out, kinda. Oh, come on. Sub-Zero, then Sonya Blade. Wi-Fi Warrior. It's wonderful. Playing this variation. I feel like I've been done dirty, but I guess that's just combat league, isn't it? I'm trying to down to like he does, like a fucking maniac, but I can't do it. Are you... How? How do you do this? I've tried playing like this before. Oh, okay. It just... I just can't do it. I just can't do it. This guy is just... Hauling buttons. He's just... <sighs> As you can probably tell, I'm a little bit angry. Jump. This fucking... Okay. That interactable. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna get hit by. It. Yeah. He punished. All right. He's been unable to punish my uh, slide before, so I held out hope. We can still win this. We can still win this. I should be mashing the back to two string, but... Can't blame me, I don't play this character. Eat a fucking long ass throw animation. Not what I meant to do. Oh. Now I'm concentrating. This is, this is like some. Yeah, I'm trying to down to it's never it never works for me. I feel like I'm done dirty. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Oh my fucking god! Look at the damage. Yeah. I mean, it was a noble effort, right? I think it was. I think it was. God, this variation is awful. And God, that was an awful match. Goodbye, 10 points. It was nice knowing you. But, it did give me a very nice score. 2-2-2-2. Two, 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 two. There's always some positivity in the end. It sounded like some motivational bullshit. That's Aaron Black... Was it called Barking Irons or some shit like that? It's bad, like, considering that situation, when the hell was I ever supposed to throw out the Molotov, not the Molotov, the Dynamite? Like, at what point could the Dynamite have helped in either of those matches? Fucking hell, this variation is awful, what the hell they were, were they thinking? And I feel like, at this point, it's like too late to change, like, some people were suggesting that Aaron Black's first variation having the enhanced uh, rifle stance and the scut shot is just too good. But I feel like even if you gave this variation the scut shot, it would just still be very bad. I don't know, man. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here, though. I'm not, I'm not gonna be the one to give opinions on Aaron Black when I don't play the character. I just get played by him online. So yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this MK video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that. And I'll see all of you next time. I don't think I even have to censor anything. There were no... Oh, there was one fatal blow. Or crushing blow. Yeah, we'll have to get to that. Thanks for watching, guys. And goodbye.